Hello everyone and welcome back to Two Bros Game Night. I'm your host, Older Bro. I'm your other host, Younger Bro. And today, we continue in Jurassic Park, the game. Yeah, with all this up I've noticed a lot of uh, visual glitches. I'm sorry. I, I just wanted to borrow them. But, but then the dinosaur was there, and I threw them, and I think it ate them. Jessica Marie Harding. First, you get caught stealing a t-shirt from the mall. Then you steal binoculars from the park and lie about it to my face. Now you've taken Laura's cigarettes? You let the raptors get to us because you wanted to smoke? Mom does it. I wanted to calm down dinosaurs here. I was all nervous and, and anxious and stuff, and I thought it would help. That's not the point. It's not just the smoking. It's, it's stealing. It's not listening. Rem Remember, the main reason you're on this island is because your mother thinks I might be able to straighten you out. Somehow. Right. Not because you want to see me or anything. Look, you don't have to worry about me, Dad. I'm almost yeah. 15. I can take care of myself. Dr. Harding has Only a lot of kids. He has, like, anyways. three or four. Oh, yeah. honey, I know it feels like that. Especially at your age. But you're not an adult. You might be a young woman. Uh, uh, physically. But emotional maturity, I don't. Takes time. Okay? I'm sorry, Dad, but how many times have you been married? Your kids. Have you even talked to Sarah lately? There's Did Sarah Harding. Even? Yeah. Should you For be like second movie. anyone about emotional maturity? Damn. Uh, plant's gonna blow, right? We ain't got time for this after school special crap. Locked, all right. They're yelling in the background. Thanks for double checking. That bend. It may lead to the other side of the door. Hate to break it to you, Doc, but ain't none of us fitting through there. Maybe. I don't know. I, don't... I think Dr. Sorkin could, probably. Or Billy. Yeah. Any suggestions, Mr. Yoder? No. All right. I'll go ask an adult. Uh. <laughs> Situations like this make me glad I never had kids. I haven't seen my daughter in almost six months. Oh. I'm sorry. So, what are our options? No one can break it down. Too secure. Got no guns, no explosives. You tell me. Yeah, nope. okay. I'm not laughing. Someone who claims she's Jerry, ready to be treated please. like an adult probably Is shouldn't be such a little snot. Also, I'm Jerry, Enough! When I we get you home, need to speak I'm going to be having a long talk with your mother about this. All right, enough! I apologize. I'm sorry. Jess, we will finish this later. How can I help? We have a situation. The only way around the door to the power plant is that vent. And Jess is the only one of us who might fit inside. Absolutely not. My daughter has clearly shown that she can't be trusted with her own safety. She doesn't leave my sight from now on. We're just going to have to find another solution. <laughs> no. Nope. Dude. Jess? It's okay. Pretty sure the dinosaurs haven't been using that vent. What? <laughs> what? What dinosaurs? Oh, my God. Jess. Yeah. I can probably prove what? that any one of us could fit in that vent. Besides well Jesse, Jess. yeah, because Jurassic yes. World Aftermath has the same vents. Yep. Okay. And Listen a grown adult can we fit through all of them. The yeah, they're fine. Pressure to prevent any more buildup. What are we looking for? A power console, and probably a master release valve. Look, of course, the sorry. font in here is I'm also. What? To... Hold on. Why is the font in here side. also the Jurassic Park font? Just this is just mechanical side. shit. There's they no visitors back it here. To Good. But I no one's gonna see you. this. The Sorry. workers will. They don't give a shit about the bre the logo on the fucking geothermal. See that large valve wheel up there. I think that's the pressure release we're looking for. Engine likes their uh, their IP. Yeah, their IP. Fucking course they do. Why is there a f no? Hold on. They they do intend for people to be back here. There's one of the fucking things that was at the we ride earlier. That's for kids. The They're Otherwise planning the to tour kids through the geothermal right. power plant. Don't release the for pressure yet. Sake. Wait until I get the power off. Understood. Do 
You cannot talk to her. I can't talk to anybody. Nope. Look at all those transformers. The plant produces enough power to run a small city. Makes sense. I mean, it is an active volcano. That looks like the power console. Up there, at the top of the ladder. No one ever says, damn, it's hot in here. It probably isn't that hot in here. <laughs> I can see steam coming off the... Over there. Yeah, I guess that's fair. Uh, what does that say? Site safety. Yeah, they're gonna have to update that sign. <laughs> yeah. Uh, th this is one of those things where there's been no accidents. Yeah. Well, well that's clearly untrue. It's been 18 days since an accident. There was an explosion. accident 18 days ago. Why aren't they closed now then? Which is probably closer to 20 I'm days just ago. Glad now. it's not my job to explain it to the board. Not your brand, eh? Not I'm your so brand! <laughs> I understand. All too well, I'm afraid. Especially right now. But hey, maybe this disaster is just the push I need to quit. Really? Hell no. I'm so hooked I could smoke a lot of Hell no. Already there. I want my nickname. Oh, shit. Thank you. <laughs> oh. oh, it's so good. All right. Looks like we pressed open the circuit in order to turn the power off. Yeah. Here See, the open nothing. does make sense because you to open. open... Does make sense. Yeah. It does now. <laughs> exactly. You open the circuit, and when an open circuit does not allow power. We don't when you close, close the circuit, the circuit the it allows first. the power through. We can't pump the capacitor until the steam is Also, vented. why the fuck was he saying he was confused? One of them is a red color, which is the universal stop. One is the green color, which is the universal go color. Oh. Like. Could you guys give me a hand with this valve? It won't budge. Sure. We open pickle jars, too. Your engine's private security. You'll do as you're told. On three. One, two, three. Stop! Stop! We got this! Oh, I mean stop! It shouldn't take that much force to turn the valve. There must be some kind of motorized assist for it. If you force it, you could break something. I'll have a look. If there is a motor, <coughs> we'll need to disconnect it before it'll turn manually. There she is. That compartment there. That could house the motor we're looking for. I'll check it out. I love how at this point, those are giant rats. Um, yeah. At this point, somehow the person who just kidnapped him and his wife is more trustworthy. Or sorry, him and his daughter. Sorry, my mistake. Is more trustworthy than his daughter. Yeah, that's <laughs> that has got to be the worst okay, burn that you could ever possibly have, and you are in an active don't volcano. Don't need any. It's just a latch. That's handy. I guess the need to yank that thing out in a hurry was anticipated. I got it. Perfect. Let's try it again. <clears throat> Let the Oscar do it. Ugh. That's it. The steam has been vented. All we need now is to turn the power back on. You uh, need any help? To press I'm a button. Capable, thank you. No, we, have to, <laughs> we have to prime it first. One. Two. How many times you to prime this damn thing? Four. Four. Even though it's three in the movie, I'm pretty sure. close light. It means the charge is pumped. Right. <laughs> I'm 
going to close the circuit and turn the power back on. Hold on to your butts. Please don't blow up. Please don't blow up. Please don't blow up. I think you'll find we have nothing to worry about. Did, are you trying to kill us all? What's happening? Laura, nothing to worry about, huh? It's all right, everyone. It's just a fail-safe measure to protect the plant. We probably set it off when we disconnected the motor or something else. Everything is just fine. Please stop talking. What is just if fine? If you say so. Oh, no. Hey, can one of those get their back crushed under the door? Their tails would be. Run for the ladder, Nemo, before they can cut you off. This is easily failable. I mean, they're all easily failable. The door controls. They're completely fried. Just throw them in a volcano. Could these doors be open manually? I'm afraid not. The only way we can get them open is by using the controls by the doors where we came in. I'm on it. No, no way. That's suicide. I killed I, one. I'll kill three more. They were still afraid of you. I'll just have to give them a new reason to be scared then. Can we at least talk about this? No. You know damn well I'm the only one's got a chance to get to that control panel. Maybe, but who says you have to go alone? I do. Look, Billy, we gotta get these people out of here. I figure they got no chance with both of us gone. Crap. Okay, I want everyone to hang tight while I figure this out. You're going to be fine. What's the plan? Working on it. I'll let you know. <clears throat> Yeah, there's some visual glitches when I move the camera, as you can see on those uh, yeah, tran bit. transformers down there. Uh, yeah. yeah, that is just an active lava flow. Yeah, I don't know how the hell they're not complaining about the heat. Yeah, it should be over 150 degrees in here. Actually, let me confirm that. that. I've made jumps that wide before. All right. I want you to tempt those raptors by creeping down the ladder. Oh, okay. Before, I thought you were nuts, but that sounds like a great plan. You got something better? You can always throw the doctor lady down there. That will distract them. You could die. Don't count me out yet. All right, Oscar. Give me a diversion, will ya? Couple of seconds at least. Got it. Hey. Thanks. All right, Oscar, the man, the myth. He's doing it. Yeah, that's not a. Uh, those temperatures are not on uh, impossible. I just looked up and it says that, yeah, near active lava flows, it's regularly over 120 degrees. So, hmm. and those are for like non-active volcanoes. Hope he makes it back. So. Like, 150 plus degrees down here is possible. Also, I'm not sure that's lava and not magma. Yeah, Nima knows this, man. Yeah. I mean, does she know him personally? Yes. Oscar! Actually, don't tell me. That's it. Just keep focused on Billy. It's 
So there's another section that likes to fail you before you win. Close the door. Why didn't you close the door? They're about to. Now barricade the door. their fear response. Something about this place scares them. But even if they weren't scared, you look ready to hold them off. Thanks. And I'm glad I didn't have to. Are you okay, Billy? No. What the hell do you think? What Oscar did was very brave. When we get back, we're gonna make sure he is duly recognized for his- You think I care about that crap? Let's just give him some space. Five minutes. Just just give me five minutes and I'll be fine. I know what you people think of us. Bunch of blue-collar grunts, right? Bunch of high school dropouts. We're replaceable. Yeah, we Billy's losing that. Man. We don't. Tell him. Oscar was worth a thousand of you, but he knew it. And he still died to save your ass. So don't tell me how you're going to honor him. You don't deserve okay, to. Okay, What can we do? Nothing. I said I'll be fine, remember? All I need... Is space. Poor Billy. I know we've got a lot on our minds, but whatever spooked those raptors might be nearby. <coughs> Laura's right. I need everyone to be alert while she and I search the room. What is that? Hey, it smells like the jungle. Only more rotten. <laughs> Jess, you don't want to see this. Nima, could you? Yeah. Come with me, Jess. Try not to look, okay? Alright. Oh, maybe from there. Oh, what? How in the fuck are you alive? Yes, yes, they look just like... Just like the ones Nima had, I know. He's alive, but only technically. He's paralyzed and almost certainly brain dead. This is the Venom's final stage. Goodness. What? <coughs> Laura. Eggs. It is a nest. I thought the structure looked like the nest of a cassowary, maybe an emu. 
But without eggs, I couldn't be sure. Yes, but... but they're inside him. If you'd asked me five minutes ago, I'd have told you such behavior didn't exist outside of class and secta, but Whoa. now... He's a human being. Look, I'm I'm, con sorry. I'm trying to figure out what's right. going on. Yeah, she's trying to I'm not to impressed assess. here. She's trying to assess the situation. This guy's dressed a lot like you, Billy. Does he have a tattoo on his arm? Like mine? Yeah. Yes, yes, he does. What the hell's going on over there? Is he alive or not? He's alive, but in a comatose state. Something has laid eggs in his abdomen. Something what? That's fucked up. The victim is being kept alive by... Decaf! A... I'm sorry? The victim is Daniel Kafaro. Another throwaway grunt. Oh my god. I knew they'd gotten out somehow, but I never thought... You knew about this? You knew? Ugh. I'll kill you! Oh boy. Oh boy. Let us begin the even longer chapter. The final chapter. Each chapter is the same length. Uh, sure. But I suppose this one technically has an extra scenario since there's two different endings. Yeah, how I usually do endings, guys, is I usually do the good ending first and then the bad ending. I think I'm gonna switch it. Tell us, Doctor, what's out there? What did this to him? Tro they're called Trodon Pectinodon. They were meant so to the Trodon from you this game no, no. I kept and the Herrera source is what inspired the I thought they may have been leaving the pen somehow, but I wasn't certain the designs for uh, Jurassic World Evolution. We were out there exposed, humping around like idiots looking for our pilot. Well, if not the designs, definitely how they behave. Probably bitten by one of those things just like decaf. Who knows where his catatonic body is now? Both our teams are dead. Oscar's dead. All because of your dinosaurs, all because of you. Journal. Help those things. Oscar doesn't want this. He died helping us all survive. He wouldn't want her dead. Had he known, though. Anyway, this witch is a liar. She's lied to all of us. Put me in the direct line of danger to protect her agenda and her precious freak show. What else is she hiding? Please, if I knew sooner. Oh, I... Shut it. <clears throat> is that what this is all about? She put you in danger? You're acting out of vendetta here? Oh, don't turn this around on me. I'm doing this for Decaf and Vargas. But what is all this? She's a liar. How can you deny that? Yes, she lied to all of us, but she also helped when she could. Nima is alive because of her. She could have warned us. I wasn't entirely sure yet. For all I knew, she could have gotten into the quarantine pens. Oh, so what? I'm the enemy? I'm the bad guy here? I'm just trying to open your eyes. I'm trying to show you the truth and bring someone to account for it. Just it, Billy. She's not the one responsible. This falls on the shoulders of Hammond and Ingen. And now we're all suffering for it. Still. Billy, let her go. We need every able mind and body we can get. All she has to say is it's my fault. It's my fault. Come on, Doc. Let me hear it. No, it wasn't. Say it! It's... It's m my fault. There. Not so difficult, was it? Your friends never saved you here. At least I got the truth out of this. You want her alive? You've got it. Woo! You just mark my words. She will save just one of those animals before she lifts a finger to help you. Now, here's the thing. I don't think useful. Billy was wrong about that. Maybe not. I mean, she Guess already sort of did that. Let's just give Billy a minute and see if we can find anything useful. A way out, even. Okay. We'll do a sweep of the room and check in when we're done. Agreed? Again, the previous kidnapper is somehow the most trustworthy person in the room. How can that happen? Here like a rat. Yeah, Nima and Billy Yoder kind of swapped roles. 
Jess, stay close to me, okay? I'll keep you safe. Dad? Well, I think he just found his fourth wife. <laughs> Maybe it's clear. Leave the door alone. We're not going back out that way. Why not? Because we aren't backtracking, and those damn creatures could still be out there. Okie dokie. <clears throat> Yes, you said that right. So, each character in this room except for Dr. Sorkin can get a flare. So, that's the goal. I was going to say, I'm going to guess we shouldn't oh, we'll click on that one yet. I don't want to get stuck in a vent with a dinosaur. Besides, there's blood everywhere. Ow! Hot! Well, just got third degree burn. What can you remember about that animal that bit you? I didn't see it when it attacked. It, it went by so fast. It was dark. After it bit me, I became confused, like, like I'd been drugged. I remember there were many of them. They had glowing eyes. Glowing eyes? Yeah, like ojos del lobo. Jess, stay away from the vents. No more sneaking off, understand? I'm not going anywhere, Dad. I'm sorry that I'm struggling to believe you right now. These Trodon, what else can you tell me about them? Well, they're nocturnal. They're intelligent, like raptors, but they don't hunt like them. They envenomate with a single bite, then back off. Stalk their prey. Their teeth are serrated and retain saliva, and the saliva is saturated with the toxin. Nima's bite. It was from a Trodon? Yes, definitely. Great. It's locked. Does anyone happen to have a key? Or bolt cutters. What about this grate? It looks big enough for everyone. And it looks like it's heading in the right direction. Billy, we should cover decap. I don't want Jess to see this. Yeah. Are you okay? Jess, hon, leave him alone. I don't understand. I thought the dinosaurs couldn't breathe. <coughs> They can't. They're all female. Then how do they lay eggs? Theropods shed eggs just like most other ovip um, egg-laying animals. Think about chickens. The whole egg market is made up of unfertilized eggs, right? Oh, yeah. So they still have to lay them? Oh, my. What is it? You bring up a good point about our dinosaurs ovulating, but these eggs are gathered in a clutch. This is brooding behavior. So, chickens will brood a large enough clutch? But not our dinosaurs. I've found post-ovulatory eggs in the ranges. They're mal-shaped, usually destroyed or kicked into the bush. I see. Wait, it, we can't jump to any conclusions. How could this even be possible? Could a girl dino turn into a boy dino? With Dr. Wu's slapdash approach to gene sequencing, anything could go wrong. I love the fact that the entire reason they used frog DNA was because the frogs they specifically used could change from male to female as necessary to I would know how. I uh, breaking and reproduce and, and cause this problem. Tendencies. Like, that was the reason they chose that specific animal. It was because those frogs are known for being able to not even, like, to literally change their biology. Yeah, but that wasn't engine's intent. That was no, but that's accidental. why the movies chose them. Like they, that's like engine Tunnel, didn't intend that because they didn't know. But that's Maybe why the that's why the movies said that. 
You don't know what's down there. I'm just because it was help. they are I the know, one Jess, just uh, creature type that is known for that doing that specifically you. outside of clownfish. Sorry to be and obviously they weren't going to use clownfish DNA. Nope. Could I pick this lock? Damn it. Not that I would know how. I don't want to add breaking an entry onto my dad's list of my criminal tendencies. So this whole trip was like set up to scare me away from shoplifting. Mission accomplished. <laughs> okay. So we're going to have to stop there. Yes, we are. So that's going to be it for this episode. We'll come back next time and continue on in Jurassic Park the game. Until then, the future is very uncertain. What is certain is that dinosaur is not in this section, or it might be in this section of the game, but it's not uh, one that we're familiar with. Uh, also, you guys are awesome, and there'll be more Two Bros Game Night tomorrow. See you then. Goodbye.